you probably know that nowadays, thanks to artificial intelligence, you can do some seriously cool stuff in the world of visual content creation and social media. One awesome thing you can do is create your own consistent character, perfect for animations, visual storytelling, or even as a virtual influencer. Now, here's the deal. Premium AI accounts can be a bit pricey, and you might not want to incur that cost. Today, we're going to create our own character using AI for free. So, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to stay tuned for more. There are many ways to create consistent characters. For example, you could go with Midjourney, which has seriously simplified the process and produces incredible outputs. However, you need to pay between $9 to $96 per month for it. Or, you could try out Leonardo.ai, which offers two very useful features. One of them is training AI to generate your desired character. With this feature, you can introduce your character to AI by uploading a set of images, and then instruct it to place the character in poses, environments, or even clothing styles of your choice. Pretty cool, right? Or you can try using Fix Seeds, which is also an acceptable option. However, Keep in mind that in the free version, certain features like photorealistic rendering, alchemy, etc. are disabled, and using Leonardo.ai might not be as straightforward for some. Now, I want to tell you about a simpler way to achieve acceptable results. You can have a 3D character for yourself who is eating sandwiches, walking, riding a bicycle, sleeping, playing guitar, or even driving, but maybe not driving very skillfully. You might have heard of TensorArt. This AI platform does many things. One of them is generating images, and fortunately, it's perfect for creating all sorts of realistic and cartoonish characters. As you may know, this platform gives you 100 credits daily, and it only deducts 0.8 credits for each generation, which is quite suitable for us. After you enter the website, head over to the AI Tools section to explore all the cool features. Swap face, deep fake, drawing to photo, photo to caricature, and several other features. There's so much you can do here. To sign up, click on the Sign In button and log in using your Google account. Then, select the 3D option in the Model section. You'll find a variety of options to choose from, each offering a different style. Once you've made your choice, click on Remix and replace the default prompt with your own specific instructions for your desired character. The more detailed you are about the character's appearance, the better the results will be. You can write down age, hair color, hairstyle, clothing, shoes, or anything that comes to your mind here. In the negative prompt section, you can add details to prevent potential errors. Next, select your preferred size. For the free versions, the sampling steps option should be less than 25. As you know, the same values for the seed option can create the same images for you, so I think it's better to click here to use the current image seed. The next section is about upscaling the image, which you can use. However, keep in mind that more credits will be deducted from you. Now, we can click on Generate and see the first image. It's not bad. Now, we can download it or use options like InPaint, Upscale, Image to Image, and Remix to achieve our desired output. Additionally, with this AI, you can animate the generated image and create a cool video. Now let's just make a small change in our text. For example, changing walking to eating a sandwich and see the result of the work. Now let's try running. The result is good, but if you want the color of the t-shirt, the logo on it, and other details to be consistent, you should add them to the text. Now, let's try dancing in a club, which looks a bit odd with this outfit. Playing football, playing the guitar, writing a letter, standing, sitting, horseback riding, smoking, sleeping, cycling, and playing cards with a smile or without a smile. If you see the color of the socks changing, it's because I didn't mention it in the text. I hope this video has been helpful to you. Stay creative until next time.